This is going to be a quick tip to show you how to retopologize uh, something like a limb in Modo 601. So we're going to do this arm. We're in the topology tab. In the background layer, we've got this uh, this figure, and we've got an empty mesh in the foreground layer. So there's many ways you could start off. You could maybe use the pen tool to create an initial uh, strip of uh, polygons, but I'm going to show you a different way. So if you look down the length of this arm and hit Control Home, that's going to align your work plane to the view. And uh, you can use the page up and page down keys to reposition it if you like. And then I'm going to hit F2 to bring up my modeling tools. And I'm just going to get a cylinder and literally just draw out a cylinder around the arm. Now don't worry too much about the positioning. It doesn't need to be accurate. It really just needs to be there and just be uh, surrounding the geometry of the arm. I'm just going to drag out a cylinder and then drop the tool and then just select the caps and hit delete to get rid of those. Now because we're in the topology tab, all these tools in this toolbar here will automatically constrain to the background. So if I select the smooth tool and just drag in the viewport, it will constrain this new geometry to the background mesh. So now I'm going to hit end to reset my work plane and control one to bring up the pie menu and just hide it and I'm also going to dismiss this um, toolbar and I'm going to bring up my topology pen just quickly fix the uh, topology I've created now if I if I right click on an edge loop it will drag the whole loop out and if I hold shift and right click it will drag out a new strip of polygons so very quickly I can just retopologize this arm if I want to add loops in between these segments I hold down the uh, shift key and middle mouse button and I can quickly create new loops and again at the top here, shift and right click just to create a new uh, strip of polygons and shift middle click just to add a loop there. So you can see that in under a minute we retopologize this whole arm and uh, it's extremely quick. Now if you like you can actually take this technique even further. So I've got my work plane in position halfway up this arm and aligned correctly and I'm going to activate my cylinder tool and uh, draw out a cylinder and uh, this time what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag it out to cover the whole length of the arm. Now um, you may not know this but you can also interactively control the number of sides and segments in the viewport so if you hold down the right mouse button and you drag left and right you can change the number of sides but I'm happy with 10 and if you drag up and down with the right mouse button down you can change the number of segments so as you can see I'm interactively adding segments to this cylinder in the viewport so uh, I'm gonna set it at uh, 10 each and uh, once I'm happy with that I'm gonna drop the tool and just as before I'm going to select the caps and delete them and uh, now if I run the smooth tool and just drag in the viewport you can see that we've uh, retopologized this arm pretty much instantly and at this point of course you could use the uh, topology pen if you wanted to fine tune some of the placement of uh, the topology but um, again it's extremely quick and uh, really versatile way of working.